What is going on guys and girls? My name is James Orthexi and welcome back today to Crazy Craft. How are we doing everyone? Welcome back. Welcome back. How are we doing everyone? I hope you are good. Yes, it is me once again in my house full of coven witches. Hello, Amethyst Coffinberry. How are we doing today? Are we good? Are we just witching around? I think so. So, today we've got a really cool episode planned and I've been looking in how to do it all. It looks really, really awesome. But sadly, today I begin with bad news because ladies and gentlemen in the last episode we did not hit the fancy lands and goal <laughs> no. so today unfortunately we will not be adding to our beautiful room full of fancy lanterns so let's back up here let's back up here and close the door Hello, darkness, my old friend. Ah, you know, it happens every once in a while, and unfortunately, today is one of those days. So thank you, of course, everyone who still poked that like button. Um, If we can lower the like goal maybe to 8,000 for this episode. So if we can hit 8,000 likes in this one, then next episode, we will be back and very, very fancy. And bonus Illuminati confirming, and we need to keep filling this room up because look at it, look at it. Oh, it's so colorful. Ah, never mind, eh? Okay, so today what we're gonna be doing is we are gonna try and get to the demonic, was it, was it demonic? No, the, the, what's it called? Uh, the infernal dimension, I think it's called. So this is like super, super awesome witchery. But in order to do that first, we are gonna have to create ourselves a demonic contract and tag lock ourselves. So we're gonna have to like have this contract written with our own DNA. And then we're gonna have to summon inf an infernal imp, befriend the imp, feed him riches and sweet meats. And then if he loves us, he'll drop us an item to summon a demon. Oh my goodness, does that sound amazing? I think that's gonna be kind of amazing. So uh, I've got a couple of the items ready for the contract but what I don't actually have is I don't have a pork chop so that's what we're gonna have to do we're gonna have to try and find a little pig somewhere piggy where are you where are you dun, 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 dun. I don't really know where the pigs are there should be some pigs around here somewhere but yeah anyway whilst we look for a pig how is everyone doing I hope you're good and stuff it is nearly December which is very exciting because it is Christmas and there's lots of stuffs um but yeah, it should be kind of cool. And as well as that, of course, if you have been tuning into the channel recently, you'll see that we've been playing a few new games. Uh, what I'm really enjoying at the moment is Hello Neighbor. So I know I'm a little bit late to the party with this because there have been videos going up from like other YouTubers for a little while, but I've got to say I'm really enjoying it. And the support for those episodes has been really, really amazing. And as well as that, of course, the uh, the Roblox, the Pokemon Brick Bronze, which is insane. It's so fun. It's ridiculous. So thank you so much uh, if you are someone who is watching those series and checking them out and stuff i really appreciate it. where are all the pigs pigs um they seem to have all disappeared what on earth? <laughs> uh on, let me try and find a pig is there a pig was a pig pig here lies my poor puppy i hate chemical x oh no <laughs> <laughs> so this is just in space. Did he did he oh no? Oh dear me. Did something bad happen? Oh snap rooms. Oh, he's got oh that's so sweet. <laughs> We've got a graveyard over by our house which just made. He likes to kind of he, he likes to give a good sending off ceremony if anything bad happens. I think that's very sweet. I can't find any pigs. This is ridiculous. There's like zero pigs anywhere on the server. Ronald! See, which, I don't know where they've gone. Like, normally there's a pig or two just porking about, you know what I mean? But today, there seems to be no pigs. But we need to get a pork chop in order to do what we need to do. So, uh, maybe I have to go even further to try and find a pig. This is really weird. Like, there's cows, there's sheep, there's chickens, there's giant terrifying robot ants. But there's no pigs. <gasps> yeah, there's a pig. Woo! And wait, we don't want to cook it. We don't want to cook it. Does this have fire aspect on it? No, no, no. Okay, okay. Oh, I'm so sorry, buddy. But it, it's all for... Oh. Oh, I thought it just gave us bacon then for a second. Woo. Okay, okay, cool, cool, cool. So look what we've got here. So now we've actually got this. What we need to do is we need to... Oh, and we also need a glass bottle. So I think I had some of those over here, I want to say. Oh, my witchery. Oh, there's an apple. Hello. Um. Okay, but I need to try... Don't look at me like that. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, okay? Uh, <laughs> but we need to try and get a glass bottle. Do we have any over here? No. We've got loads of brews of thorns. I can't remember what happens with these. Are they Are they quite cool? I can't remember. Like, Oh, yeah. It grows cactus, doesn't it? <laughs> look how cool it is. Okay, okay. So let me grab some glass bottles. 
Okay, okay, so now what I think we do is we put one pork chop in the middle, we surround it with paper, missing one corner, we put a string in, ah, and it's not worked. Uh, what have I done wrong? What have I done wrong? What have I done wrong? I'm trying to make a demon contract. This is what I want to try and do, but for some reason, this is the recipe that I thought it was, but it turns out it isn't. Hang on, let me, let me go in here, so demon, this is what I want to make, this is what I want, the demonic contract. Wait, that's what I've done! Oh, it's raw pork chop question mark. Oh, okay. So I need to combine a mutandis with a rotten flesh. So it's not a normal pork chop. Huh. <laughs> that's really strange. Okay, so that's not too big a deal. Have we got some rotten flesh here? We do. So fantastic. And I think I've got some mutandis down in one of my witchery chests down here. So if we go... Uh, mutandus, 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 where is the mutandus? Please be mutandus. Yes, okay, there we go, boom. All right, so let's try that one more time, shall we? So if we do rotten flesh with mutandus, we get raw pork chop, question mark. You know, I kind of want to eat this, just for science, to see what happens. Hmm, maybe we'll, we'll, we'll make one later on when we're hungry. Okay, okay, so let me do it like that, and then let me stick one of these bad boys there, and then that gives us the, the demonic contract. And now what we do is we create ourselves a tag lock, Kit, why is that not tag locking? Oh god, why is it? Why are all the recipes changed? Okay, tag, lock. That's what we want. We want one of these. Uh, that is a glass bottle and oh, a bone needle. Ah, so it's not a bone needle. It's because we were using an icy needle. Okay, so that's just bone and flint. Do we have any bone needles about? Uh, no, we've got icy ones. Hmm. Okay, so let me grab some flint. Right, bones, flint, bone needles. Wow, that's far too many bone needles. <laughs> 32, fantastic. All right, okay. Uh, the glass bottle, that. There we go. Tag lock, and then we need to bind it to ourselves. How do we? How do we bind it to ourselves? How do we? How do we do that? Um, we need our own DNA. Um, hmm. Oh, I tell you what, we can do. Who remembers the Zooniverse? Dun dun da. <laughs> it's been ages since we've come in here, but yeah, in case you're like someone who picked up on the series a little bit later on, uh, we built this entire zoo featuring all these types of animals and quizzes for one single prank. It was so, so worth it. <laughs> it was pretty fun. So yeah, okay, okay. Do you remember like right at the bottom, we had ourselves a leech chest. So what happens with the leech chest? Wow, the animals are still in here. <laughs> That's so cool. Okay, so uh, yeah, here it is. Here it is. Now, what you can do with this thing is basically this is a leech chest. So anyone who opens it, it takes a sample of their DNA. So if we use the tag lock kit, cannot get tag locks for the following players, Dan TDM and Real Think Noodles. Uh, why? What? Cannot get tag locks for the following players, not in this world. Oh, do they have to be online? Okay, that's no big deal. I want my own DNA, though. How do I get my own DNA from it? Because I opened it as well. See, there's three little blobs, which means that my DNA should be in there. Why is that not allowing me to take it? That's really weird. Uh, huh. Okay, okay, plan B. That's that's really strange. That should that should happen, but huh? Okay. Well, that's disappointing. So they need to be online for me to get their DNA if I want to do anything with it. I did not know that, but never mind. We've got plan B, which is we can take DNA from our own bed. There we go. Boom. So this is the tag lock kit now with my DNA in it. So if we use the tag lock with me and the demonic contract, boom, we have a signed, sealed and delivered demonic contract, which is now bound to me. So that's step one. Now, step two is we're going to have to do some circle magic and we are going to have to do do um hmm which one is it it is the we need to do a rite of summoning i think so let me have a look uh not bestial call not manifestation imprisonment uh, oh goodness which one is it this should be broken earth moving earth broiling see there's so many of these this is such an amazing mod um oh Okay, these are the summoning ones. This one, this one, this one. So call forth an imp. The inner circle area must be clear. Seven. Okay, that's fine. So we need the red glyphs around the side. We need an 11 by 11. And we need refined evil, demonic blood, an ender pearl, and an attuned stone. Right. Do we have any of those items? Probably not. <laughs> Which means we're going to have to make them. Uh, demonic blood. Do we need demonic blood? Yeah, okay. So at least we've got one of the items. Okay, so demonic blood is there. This is redstone soup. Mm, all right, let me let me get this together. This may take a little bit of time, but I'm just going to get these items together. They're not too bad. I'm going to have to do a basic summon thing to get the attune stone. 
And the refined evil. Oh, it's gonna take forever. Ah! All right, let me let me get let me get the sword, lads. Ah, oh, bear with, bear with. All right, okay. So I've um got my stuff that I need to summon the imp. But one thing that I did notice is we need 25 levels in order for the demonic contract to work. So I was thinking, well, how am I gonna get levels fast? And then I thought, hmm, we've got tons and tons of eggs. Like some of these give XP, some of them don't. But I thought, let's try the ants first because I thought this was kind of fun. So I made a splash potion of harming. Please work, please work, please work, please work. Woohoo! Did we get any XP? 19! Yeah! That was actually... What were we on? Were we on... How many were we on? I can't remember, but okay, so one splash potion did that much damage, so that's pretty cool. Uh, let me go and grab some more ants here. This seems like quite a good way of doing it, and of course, ants are just annoying, so <laughs> let's just use as many eggs as we can get from this, this amazing egg-giving machine. Uh, there's some more rainbows. Hmm... Where else are we going to get some? Uh, are there any in here? Uh, da, 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 da. Oh, man, there's so much stuff here. This is insane. Okay, some more rainbow ants. Uh, let me try and find these all. That, that's quite hard to spot, isn't it? All right, okay, and round two. Here we go. Oh, we've missed a couple. Let me just stick a couple of these bad boys in. And three, two, one. Splash potion of damage. Man, look how colorful that is. <laughs> isn't that crazy? Oh, my goodness. Look at that. Isn't that insanely pretty? Okay, okay. Three, two, one, boom. Yeah. Woohoo. And we got a 20. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. What's happening? What, lads. Oh, the termites didn't die. What? They tanked a, a splash. Are you kidding me? Oh, there we go. <laughs> now they're dead. Yeah. Okay, so we've got our 27 levels. Nice. All right. Now, I think it is time we give this a go. So I've got the circle ready here uh, with the infernal chalk. It's 11 by 11, which uh, should be fine. And I've got my demonic blood. I've got my attune stone. This is not charged. I don't know if we were supposed to charge it or not, but we've got our refined evil and uh, we've got our ender pearl. Okay. So hopefully this should summon the imp. So attuned stone, refined evil, ender pearl, and then we've got our demonic contract, which is bound. We've got our 25 levels. So moment of truth. Boop. Oh, what? What have we missed? What have we missed? What have we missed? How does that not work? The inner area must be clear. Oh, what? The right of summoning. Refined evil, demonic blood, ender pearl, attuned stone. Maybe the stone has to be charged. Maybe? I mean, we've got we've got everything that we need. Is this cactus in the way? Is this, is that why? Huh. Interesting. Um, did I get this right? Oh, no, I've got the circle wrong. <laughs> Oops. No wonder it doesn't work. Oh, James, what are you doing? Okay, no, no bother, though. What we can do is we can just grab this, which is going to take forever to break. Come on. Oh, no, that's golden chalk. Hang on. Do we have another golden chalk? We should do. Uh, I think I've got one at the base. Hang on, hang on. Bear with, bear with. Okay, so it would help if we actually put this thing in the middle, wouldn't it? Um, <laughs> okay, okay, so let me grab the, uh, the graspers, and we'll just put them like that again, uh, which is fine. Yeah, that's in the middle this time. Okay, let's try that again, shall we? So refined evil, attuned stone, ender pearl, and demonic blood, like so, and boop. No, 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 I've missed it. Hang on, hang on. Boop. Boop. Yes, okay, it's doing it, it's doing it. So this should summon an imp. Come on, imp. I call you forth. Oh. You require more coven members to perform this right? What? I've got maximum coven, don't I? I've got four. Huh? Do I need more co- Oh, that's the last thing I want. More witches popping up. <laughs> okay, so... Hmm. That's really weird. I mean, we've got enough charge... You need more coven. Well, okay, so I'll, I guess I'll go and summon more coven witches then. Oh, okay. Well, that took forever. And do you know what I think happened? Do you remember like ages and ages and ages ago when we were doing witchery, we actually had our own like buddy. So this is a new familiar. Like we had an owl who was a familiar. I think he must have died or something because all the owls in our houses haven't been made familiars. And the one that you make a familiar gets like a health boost. So I had to do it all over again. And this is our brand new, well, I say all over again. I just 
had to like basically do a rite of binding to, to like it's this one here look at this rite of binding so I had to use Tear of Goddess Odor of Purity Whiff of Magic uh, Diamond and Demonic Blood uh, in an 11 by 11 so I've made it back to the Infernal but it was just like the ritual so I've changed that again and now we have a brand new owl familiar called Archimedes and he's really cute although he's kind of dead right now can we can we can we do oh no <laughs> okay I think I need to get some like proper pork or beef for him but you know what for now he's fine and I actually went and got myself another coven witch so now I think we have a full coven full of witches which is just <laughs> which is fantastic literally okay and as well as that I also got a refined and a tune stone which is charged because if this doesn't work then uh then we can try it that way so I've been pretty busy <laughs> I really hope this is going to work. So let's try this one more time. What? Why won't you work? Owl. You sp oh, why is my coven not summoning? Why? I don't understand what I'm doing wrong. Um. Oh, all right, let me look into it again. This is driving me mad. Like, I've got a full coven full of witches. And I thought when you use them, uh, like a summon which requires them, they get summoned in automatically, right? I guess I'm wrong. Unless. Oh. I didn't put it down right. <laughs> oh, I'm an idiot. Okay, okay. Uh, <laughs> I'm blaming the game when it's just me that got it wrong. So, whoop. Yes! It's doing it! Finally! I knew we did it right. Come on, Imp. Come for... What? You require more coven members to perform this right. I have a full coven of witches. What? Oh, I don't know what I'm doing. Hang on, let me try and figure this out. Right, this has to work. So, what I forgot was that I needed... Ow! Oh, don't shoot, no! What are you do? Oh, come on, just let me have... Oh, he's got Ronald on his head! Oh my goodness, what on earth is going on? So, finally, I figured out that I needed the Seer Stone, which calls forth your Coven Witches, if you are to do this. So, please let this work. I I'm just begging you, lads. Please. Yes! Now my Coven is getting summoned in. Finally! Oh, yes! All the members of the Coven are here. And hopefully this is going to work. So, I've got a full Coven of Witches, as you can see. But I needed the Seer Stone to summon them forth. And yeah! We've got an imp! Ow, he's angry with us. What? Hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. I need, I need the demonic contract. Hang on, hang on. Demonic contract. Offer. Please, be cool with me. <laughs> Here he is. His name is Turnak Monontoblus. We have a deal. Yes, I've struck a deal with an imp. He follows me now. Come on, imp. Imp. Be my, be my friend. Imp, what are you doing? I don't know what... I, imp. C come here. Okay, okay, okay. So, what do I give this guy? I don't know what to give him. He says give him, like, rare items. What if I gave him a charged, attuned stone? <laughs> Me not like. Just new, shiny things. Hmm. Okay, shall I get some diamonds or something? Maybe he's gonna like those. I'm not too sure. Okay, okay. Uh, oh, there's another thing you can do as well with him. I think if you give him a certain item, he grows bigger for a little bit. Uh, let me try and find that item as well. But what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna grab some diamonds because maybe that's gonna work. I don't know. See, the thing is we have to offer him, like, treats and stuff, and eventually he will drop the item that we need. So... That's been such a mission to summon in this imp, but I really hope it's going to be worth it. Um, so let me grab some diamonds. Um, hopefully, maybe this is going to work. I don't know. I really hope so. Oh, there's a Pac-Man. There's a big Pac-Man. There's a big Pac-Man. Woohoo! <laughs> Did he drop anything cool? Did he drop anything cool? Oh, he's got a little inventory. Oh, what's that? What is that? Uh, an ender chest pair. Oh, cool. <laughs> he dropped an ender chest pair and he also dropped this little guy, which is a quantum crystal monster. Unfortunately, we've already got those. So that's a bit of a shame. But okay, okay. Let me try this again. So Imp, be my friend. Please, please be my friend. Please, Imp. Yeah! I has a secret, secret to share. What did he give me? A tape measure. <laughs> no, what did he actually give me? A, w a waffle? Did you give me a... Wait... Did you, oh, that, that's what he gave me. Look, look, look. He gave me, oh, the soul of the demon, a hunger demon? Soul of a hunger demon. Nice. Okay. Wow. He took like, how many diamonds did you take off me, buddy? You greedy sausage. Shinies, yawn. What do you want now? Oh, you're such a little troll, aren't you? <laughs> look at his face. <laughs> oh, please be my friend. Um, I've lost my imp. Oh, there he is. <laughs> okay, so, ladies and gentlemen, 
We've got an imp. I don't know. I, I kind of want to call you like Stephen or something. I don't know. But his name is Tinrag Monobulus. <laughs> He's really cheeky looking. Okay. So he's taken all of my diamonds and he gave us one of his items. But there's lots of different items that he can give us. The thing is, it may take us some time in order to actually get the items that we need. So, I think we are gonna have to call it there for this episode because unfortunately we have run out of time. But what I will do is I will keep feeding him some diamonds and hopefully he will drop the item that we need. So, so far he's dropped us the soul of the hunger demon, but we need to get some more things. So I'm just going to let him play around on the trees. But yeah, ladies and gentlemen, thank you so much for watching this episode here today where we successfully, after a lot of trial and error, summoned a very, very cheeky little imp. So it's kind of cute. So if we can try and get this episode to 8,000 likes, that would be amazing. Thank you so much for your continued support here on Crazy Craft. And I think next episode, what we'll try and do is we'll try and go and do the awesome hunger demon thingamajig summoning going to the torment dimension. And it should be really fun. So I'm looking forward to it. But yeah, if you're not yet subscribed, go for it because we do Minecraft on fun. But until next time, thank you once again for watching. It's been such a pleasure. As always, thanks. Right.